weighing in at he's not really sure the pyro prince Judy Underwood now, a little history lesson on the pyro prince Judy Underwood as we were making our way into independent wrestling Judy Underwood woke up on our side of the block and has been pestering us ever since He's had a series of matches with MB Young. He's really built himself here. And when T2T Brooklyn took over, he took offense because he may not like us, but he will defend our barn. And right now, Juni and Gianni one-on-one. -on -one. Well, there's that welcome back chance that I think Gianni wanted. But it's for Juni Underwood. We have not seen Juni in a while. I mean, Juni is tagged up with the Dangerous Knights crew, but... He's sort of been our Batman Beyond main character. I mean, he's he's coming back and reinventing himself every time he's here. And he's defending the barn of 880 tonight. Look, Juni Underwood, that's oh, a big slap by Gianni. Michael Enrico not taking too, too highly to Juni Underwood, stealing his thunder already. Oh, double leg, and we're going to fist right away. Juni Underwood fired up as usual. Juni has made some appearances since we've seen him. Gianni wants to talk about him making states. Gianni and David Lawless now. But Juni, Juni's been on the television since we last seen Juni. Yeah, doing, doing what you gotta do to make a name for yourself in this business. Of course, out of the other side, Pennsylvania working closely with Speedball Mike Bailey. Been working with Journey Burke, with Ricky Price. Looks just like Ricky Price. <laughs> we are, again, we're back in the crowd. Referee George counting. I don't know if that, does anything. Of, I don't yeah. know if that does anything. Hey, turn around, Big oh! T. That'll do something. The torchbearer of 880 Wrestling taking it straight through your computers at home. Judy Underwood, as you said, made that transformation. Judy is a great great person who I've had countless conversations with. Really, really uh, love his, the way he sees the business. And, and Oh, wow, David Lawless doesn't though, and oh. has grabbed his foot. Unfortunately for Juni, did not see that coming. Back when we were on the same side of the coin about 880 Wrestling, you remember the World Series where Juni yeah. and Gianni and David Lawless were one formation and he was working for the Dangerous Knights crew. Of course, we popped some bottles to end that night. Yeah, look, that's, that's the way wrestling works. You know, sometimes uh, an alliance can be a convenience, sometimes it can be uh, an inconvenience. And, and I think Juni Underwood, for whatever reason at that time, you know, that was his convenient uh, alliance. And now, obviously, he doesn't feel that way anymore. With Juni Underwood, it's always it's always been he's been a lone shark. So if anybody wanted to adopt him in their gang, he was adopted. But now he's embraced being a lone wolf. He's embraced being a son no longer lost. We once called him the lost son, but I think he's us. I think he's us now. Yeah, Gianni saw that kick coming, oh. and boy, talk about closing space. Gianni, Michael, and Rico can just do it all. <laughs> That suplex there. High five from David Lawless. And I don't blame him. That was a textbook suplex cover. Oh, one count. And Gianni, Michael, and Rico unfazed. Look, when Gianni can get control of his opponent, he gets into a different level confidence-wise. It just, it just, everything starts to click. Oh, against the buckle here. What did I get? Strong arming him, as one would say. Trying to get for that, pull for that hair, anything to get him down. Oh, taking his time as Gianni, the former 880 champion. Cover. Two, ooh, just a two count. Yeah, not enough on the shoulders from Gianni, Michael, and Rico to really put that away. But look, he is in full control. Juni Underwood, and I gotta say, I mean, we, we're seeing a different Juni Underwood. Juni usually lives in that hatred of the audience, that, yeah. that no man's land. And I don't know if Juni 
has that same fire inside of him. I'm not seeing it right now. I'm seeing Juni Underwood struggle. Usually Juni is the one dictating, strategizing, and now Juni's just reacting. That's funny you say that. The closer he becomes to 880 wrestling, the more you disagree with him. Well, it's not that I disagree. I mean, are you going to tell me that Juni was in control? Big slap across the chest there. Firing up against Big G. Reversal here. Oh, caught! Down Look at to the one strength. knee. Look at the strength. Able to hold on and right into a bear hug. Full control by the Italian strongman. Again, it feels like Judy is just reacting. He's not strategizing, he's not thinking. He's reacting out there and he's not able to, to get an upper hand on Gianni Michael Enrico. Oh, well he's got some upper teeth. That's the Judy we know. Gotta tap into that. Oh, big back elbow. Coming back again. Oh, stepping up. See ya, boss. David Lawless trying to wake up his protege. Smart is trying to fire up Gianni Michael Enrico, but Juni Underwood trying to find something, and maybe this fire will get started inside Juni Underwood. Juni Underwood does not consider himself above Gianni. He considers this an even contest. Oh, Gianni not going down even after that oh. full shot. And again. Duck under. There we go. No, reverse. We're getting back to the classic beauty that we know. Oh! Oh, back of the head. Again, another shot by Juni Underwood. And now just trying to muscle up the strongman to the top rope. On the top rope. Oh, a little tree of woe here. Well, now. Juni Underwood in full control. Some fire in the hole for Gianni. Now got it, got to get Gianni out of that corner to get that cover. They're wasting some time. Two. Oh, I think you're right there, Marcus. Unfortunately, Gianni was too tied up in the ropes. It's all that dead weight and that he had to pull from the yeah, corner. Yeah, Juni Underwood had to pull him away in order to get a clean pinfall and unable to do it. Now trying to set up something else, but you can see the pain inside Juni Underwood. That was a lot of damage to that back and ribs that he took earlier. Oh, just caught here and swung around. Cover! Two and two count. It's not gonna keep the Pyro Prince down. Yeah, Juni Underwood able to kick out. I, I don't know what else Gianni could have done. Maybe hook the leg there. But it, I thought that was it. A big move out of nowhere, drove the air. And now Juni Underwood trying to find some breath. I think Juni looking for a bit of retribution of his own here. Well, we might be seeing the sleeper now. Setting up Go for that the sleeper. sleeper. Go I think. the oh. sleeper. Gianni trying to block. Can he break out of it? Roll through. Crucifix. Two. Oh. Able to roll through. Look out. Oh. Double leg. Jackknife. No out. Wait a minute. Sunset flip of swords. Two. Oh. Gianni Michael Enrico able to get out of it. And now big shot to the chest. Just trying to gut check now between the two of them. Oh. I don't know that I would want to get in a slap match with Big Gianni. No, Gianni, Michael, and Rico, some of the heaviest hands here at 880. And Juni Underwood might be tough, but I don't know if he's this tough. Oh, well. That was in the belly, sternum and belly. That'll break your sternum, Dino Bravo style. And another shot, and this is smart by Juni Underwood. Multiple shots. Yeah, don't wait for Gianni yep. to throw the next one. Get in there, take control. Create some space, there's Gianni. Oh, for go, kick, go. no. Oh God, oh Sleeper. no, he's got it. Oh! Sleeper! 
Sicilian sleeper. Good Jimmy night. Lo looking for that torch bearer. Super kick. Ducks out of the way. Wait a second. Shoulder, wait, shoulders down. Shoulders down. No, Gianni had to break the hold or Gianni was getting pinned. And now there's the torch bearer. The pyrotech knee, oh my goodness! Just launched his entire body and David get, Lawless. Get the cover! David Lawless is hey. now taking a, some sort of stance against some sort of... George, behind you, you know him! Is you know Lawless, what Lawless is about! Well, I think Lawless is saying that there should have been a time limit, maybe? I don't know what he's saying. Smack him! Out. Oh no! Oh, almost. Yeah, the hair slicked back. Though. Can't fix it each other. Okay. Hey, man. Roll up from behind. You can't be playing with each other's hair. Judy does it. Here is your winner, Judy Underwood. The Pyro Prince finds his retribution on a muggy day in August against the Dangerous Knights crew.